So, you're graduating. This is a milestone event that you can share with your whānau and friends. There are some important formal aspects to the graduation ceremony that might seem new, so we can help with that. Want to know what to expect? There are three parts to graduation regalia. The gown, the scarf or hood, and the trencher. Your exact regalia depends on the specific qualification you're graduating with. If you're receiving a certificate, you'll be given either a short sleeve gown, which you wear like a jacket, or a long sleeve gown. If you're given a long sleeve gown, wear it with your arms through the lower opening, not the top one. If you're receiving a degree or postgraduate qualification, you'll wear a black Cambridge style gown with two openings. Your arms go through the upper opening. For the hood or scarf, place the chest bar across your upper chest. Not everyone at graduation wears a trencher. If you're graduating with a certificate or diploma, you won't wear one. If you're receiving a degree, or you already have a degree, you will. If your regalia includes a trencher, align the short peak with your nose so the long peak faces the rear. Wear it parallel to the ground with the tassel draped to the left. Please don't throw your trencher in the air as they're easily damaged. Please don't iron your regalia either as it can damage the garments. Please follow the directions of the marshals at all times. Graduation is a complex event and your cooperation is vital. Marshals will arrange you in the correct order and seat you in exactly the right place. After the official welcome, and once the student representative has given their speech, the awarding of qualifications begins. Marshals will instruct your row to stand and then lead you to a corridor where you will line up in order, ready to enter from the side of the stage. Now's the time to check that your regalia is on correctly. If you're receiving a degree for the first time, don't wear your trencher yet. If you already have a degree, you need to have your trencher on. Once your name has been checked, you'll be directed by a marshal to move up the steps. Wait until your name is called before you walk on the stage. Walk to the Ara Tepu Kinga chairperson and shake hands with them. If you're receiving a degree for the first time, the Ara Tepu Kinga chairperson will cap you and then you put your trencher on. If you already have a degree, wear your trencher as you walk onto the stage. Instead of your qualification, you will be handed a ceremonial parchment on stage. You will have received your qualification prior to the graduation ceremony, either by mail or picked up in person. Then walk over to the Ara Tepu Kinga representative, shake hands with them with your right hand and receive your ceremonial parchment with your left hand. Your official photograph will be taken as you receive your qualification. Leave the stage down the central steps and return to your seat as directed by the marshals. If you're wearing a trencher, please remove it for the national anthem and then replace it for the exit procession. Thank you for watching. See you at graduation.